published 0431 est, the 5th of December 2017 updated 1827 est, the 5th of December 2017 Cineworld has agreed in 2.7 billion pounds reverse takeover of US chain Regal which will make it the second biggest cinema group in the world. Cineworld, which opened its first cinema in Stevenage, Hertfordshire, 21 years ago, has 2,049 screens across 221 sites in nine countries and also owns the popular picture house chain. The new combined group will have more than 9,500 screens and will see Cineworld enter the lucrative U.S. market, which boasts the world's biggest box office takings. Cineworld, which confirmed the takeover talks last week, has agreed to pay $23 a share for Regal, which it will fund largely through a mammoth £1.7 billion investor cash call. But Cineworld shareholders balked at the plans to fund the takeover with a rights issue, sending shares plummeting. Regal directors and its biggest shareholder the Anschutz Corporation have backed the acquisition, which is classed as a reverse takeover. Mookie Greidinger, chief executive of Cineworld, said Regal is a great business and provides Cineworld with the optimal platform on which we can continue our growth strategy. Strong year Cineworld has been buoyed by blockbuster movies such as Dunkirk. Pictured both companies are strongly committed to bringing a high-end cinematic experience to their customers. The deal will see the combination of Europe's second-largest cinema group with the second-largest chain in the U.S. It will give the group greater might to compete with industry leader AMC Entertainment, which last year snapped up Odeon UCI Cinemas Group in Europe. Amy Miles, chief executive of Regal, said the combination of our two great companies, Cineworld's tremendous success in the UK, as well as other markets they have entered since, and Cineworld's commitment to maintain a strong presence in the US, provide a global platform positioned for continued growth and innovation. Cineworld has been buoyed this year by blockbusters Dunkirk and Despicable Me 3, as the multiplex chain also opened a string of new sites. It also anticipates a strong slate of movie releases to help its performance in the coming months, including Paddington 2 and Justice League, and upcoming films Pitch Perfect 3, Jumanji Welcome to the Jungle, and Star Wars The Last Jedi. Fancy Cineworld also owns the Picture House cinema chain. Pictured, its central London only Ross Mould, investment director at AJ Bell, said judging by the way in which the shares have slumped since the deal was first unveiled, investors in Cineworld are concerned that the swoop for Regal will be a flop rather than a box office smash. However, at first glance, the planned purchase does just pass three of the four tests which shareholders should apply to any acquisition and perhaps this explains why its shares are holding relatively firm today. Cineworld shares were down nearly 4% in early trading, but have largely recovered since. As of 9.15 a.m., they sit at 5.43 p.a. share. However, at the end of November, they were 694.5 p.a. share, a drop of more than a fifth in a week.